The Rapa Nui established themselves on Easter Island. They overexploited the flora and fauna, depleting all resources. The ecosystem could not withstand this pressure, and extinctions of the plants and animals followed. Without resources, the Rapa Nui could no longer feed themselves and were unable to make canoes to escape. They were trapped on a small, empty island in the Pacific Ocean. The civilization collapsed in the middle of the chaos because of hunger, disease, and cannibalism. Do you think the story could not be repeated? <laughs> Here we go again! Our technological advances allow us to cut more trees in less time. We are able to build gigantic concrete buildings. We can pave asphalt thousands of square kilometers to go anywhere. We have constructed colossal ships to trawl the ocean even in remote places. No doubt we are farther ahead than the Rapa Nui. We have polluted the atmosphere, soil, and water with toxic substances that will not be degraded even after hundreds or thousands of years. We used to be few, and now we are billions occupying every spot of land on Earth. And still, we are unable to satisfy the selfish necessities of our species. In the last century, our actions caused the extinctions of 801 species. In coming decades, massive extinctions are likely to occur. According to the Red List, more than 19,000 species are threatened due to deforestation in the tropics, change of land use, residential and commercial development, mining, pollution, and climate change. Probably, we will not be able to fix the inflicted damage, but not everything is lost. You can make the difference. Change your habits. Don't waste our water resources. Avoid plastics, sprays, and agrochemicals. Turn off lights and unplug your electronics when you are not using them. Reduce, reuse, and recycle. The sum of your efforts and the efforts of many people can make the difference. Remember, the Earth is our island in the middle of the universe. Would you like to learn more about conservation, ecology, and sustainability? Come study biology and sustainability at Florida Institute of Technology, the high-tech university with a human touch.